Smollett remains steadfast that he is the victim. This after police arrested two men Friday who are now cooperating with investigators to perhaps build a case against the actor. It's another major bombshell in this story. The two brothers identified in this grainy surveillance photo, who actor Jesse Smollett says attacked him, have now been released from custody without being charged and are now working with investigators. Police sources tell NBC News the men claim Smollett paid them to help orchestrate and stage what he would later call a hate crime. Who the f would make something like this up or add something to it or or whatever it may be. After Smollett insisted he was the victim to ABC News, police now say after questioning the brothers, the trajectory of the investigation has shifted. One of the men arrested was Smollett's personal trainer and was an extra on Smollett's hit show, Empire. Sources say police are investigating whether the actor paid the brothers to stage an assault, including tying a rope around his neck and pouring bleach on him before Smollett claimed the attack was a racial and homophobic hate crime. After the brothers' apartment was searched, police collected a black ski mask and bottles of bleach. The men were arrested Wednesday, but released Friday and face no charges. Innocence prevailed, all right? My guys are walking home. They're not charged. They are not suspects in this case. With detectives making it clear they want to speak to Smollett again, the actor has now hired a high-powered criminal defense attorney. His reps releasing this statement. Jesse Smollett is angered and devastated by recent reports that the perpetrators are individuals he is familiar with. He has now been further victimized by claims attributed to these alleged perpetrators that Jesse played a role in his own attack. I'm an advocate. You do such a disservice when you lie about things like this. With Smollett under increased scrutiny, the actor stands by his story while police are closer to closing their case. Smollett claimed when he was attacked, the perpetrator screamed, this is MAGA country, suggesting the attackers targeted him because of his, rapes, his race and perhaps because of his sexuality. He's openly gay. Investigators say they are still building a case and they will not comment beyond that.